Hello! Today, I brought you to a very special place that's close to my heart. This is Lake Conroe. Look around. Oh my goodness! I have been coming to Lake Conroe since I was uh, probably seven, eight years old. And I love it. I love it. But it also fits today's Bible message. The story is the one where Jesus walks on water. Matthew 14 verses 22 through 33. And I started thinking, oh, we could do all kind of things with this walking on water, but I think the best part is just seeing water and being out in it. The disciples, many of them were fishermen, especially Peter. Peter was a fisherman. And when Jesus had finished talking to the masses and told the disciples, get on in the boats, go on. He sent the crowds home and he went off to pray. And the disciples were out in the Sea of Galilee. They're out in the water where they've been. They're used to it. They've been going there since they were little bitty, just like me coming here since I was young. They knew the water. And they also knew that when a storm came, oh my goodness, it was going to be scary out there on the water. And that morning, just as, you know, the morning was starting to come, Jesus came down from the mountain and walked out on the water. He walked, walked on the water. And Peter saw him and said, oh, command me to come out there with you. And Jesus says, well, come on. And here goes Peter walking on the water. But it wasn't until Peter realized he was walking on the water that all of a sudden he got scared and he got frightened and he began to sink. Many times we're like that. We put our faith in Jesus and we are all gung-ho. Let's go. Let's do this. We've got this. He's got this. And then we look around and we realize what all we're doing and what all we're accomplishing and it scares us. And instead of putting our faith or keeping our faith or keeping our eyes on Jesus, we fall, we falter, we sink. So I want you this week to really focus on the idea of always keeping your eyes on Jesus. And so if we're always looking for Jesus, and we're always striving to be like Jesus, then walking on water, well, that's a piece of cake. We got this, because Jesus has got this. Have a wonderful, blessed week.